Uh, we also want to bring you an update on the I-17 southbound at Sunset Point. It has been closed for hours because of a deadly crash. It just reopened just minutes ago, so that's a little bit of good news. But we want to turn it over to Bruce Hafner, the Lions Roofing News Chopper, because he's got some new information about this crash. It was a bad one, right, Bruce? Yeah, it certainly is. And let me give you a shot, because right now, here's what's going on. They are just getting ready to let all the... Uh, backed up traffic on the freeway continue southbound on I-17 and that's the turn off at the Sunset Point but look at this backup it's been there all morning since about 3 a.m. coming down the mountain as you hit Sunset Point that rest area there Gina just above Black Canyon City everybody's stuck in that traffic we've got some really sad news to report the um, the one child has been killed in this accident and uh, two other have been transported where just non-confirmed information was that the uh, vehicle involved in this and here goes a, here, here's a shot of the semi truck being towed away uh, about a half hour ago uh, that somebody was on the side of the road working on their vehicle possibly I got to get all this confirmed and then they were struck by the semi and uh, let me give you a shot of here's the vehicle that was struck by the semi two people transported in serious condition from this accident and then we are told by the Department of Public Safety a child has been killed in this accident. So that's what it looks like from the Lions Roofing News Chopper. Uh, the traffic uh, uh, still backed up here. It's going to probably uh, start right as we speak. It looks like it, Gina. And here comes DPS. They'll get those vehicles up to speed. And there you go from the Lions Roofing News Chopper. I-17 southbound will reopen as we speak right at Sunset Point. Everybody coming down to the valley. All right, Bruce, thank you. Mm. That is so 